Now then, I'm back after what feels like a lifetime from not doing a walk, but I've been watching Euros. So, yeah, I would know if it's day to do any walking over that time period, really. <laughs> but today we're going to be doing Bofell, Esk Pike, and Rosette Pike. I mean, a bit busy, cloudy at the minute, but just here. We'll be going up Scarfell, just in back here, covered with clouds. So, uh, yeah, hopefully, we'll get some good views in that today. <sighs> That's what it's all about, innit? Getting to the top, nice view. Get your back down. Hey, see how we get on. So we're, uh, we're at the bottom of the uh, the first steep challenge, which is uh, to get us up to Bofell, which I believe 902 metres, I'm not entirely sure, but it's going to be an hard slog straight to the top. I mean, yeah, I choose these routes, don't I? Brilliant. Uh, yeah, it's starting to get harder now. It's starting to feel it on legs a bit. I can see the route up. It's getting uh, steeper. The view behind me is absolutely unreal. You can just see in distance. I don't know if you can. No, probably not. Just over here. All the other sets of mountains coming into play. But. Still no sign of seeing the, the top of Scarfell, which the last time I come and did it, couldn't have the sea out, too cloudy, until we got to the bottom. Fingers crossed this time, when we get up that way, we can at least see something half decent. Hopefully. Sun's starting to come out now, and already getting a dab on, so the fleece has come off. Still a bit of a breeze, but it's just nice. So that's the top of both hang there. So, uh we're almost done, almost at the top. So we're uh, just coming up the last steep percent up below fell. I mean, it's tiring, but I'm pretty sure with the weather as it is today, there's no real clouds over this side, so we should have a very, very good, clear view. 
Oh, boy. Now we're at top now. Just having a quick breather before we do the last, what, 30 meter maybe. But yeah, this little bit don't look like much. It's a killer. Yeah, it's a killer, it's good on the legs. But it's a little bit cold, especially with clouds coming just over the top. There she is, top of both fell. Oh, nearly, nearly there. So now that both hell's done, we're gonna head over towards Esk Pike. See what that's about. So that'd be the second peak of the walk so far. I mean there's not many on this one to be fair. It's just a big loop that I fancy doing. So uh yeah. So we're on his way to Esk Pike now. Four mile in. Whew. Six mile ago. So we're uh, just at the bottom of Esk Pike now, just about to go up. I mean, views that way absolutely unreal. Up behind, I can't even see the top of Esk Pike. Hopefully, we get up, we get above the cloud again among the. We'll see ya uh, a lot more then. Hopefully. Hello. Okay. See? And now, the cloud's disappeared, and I've got my jacket off again. <sighs> Crazy. <sighs> I prefer it to be like this, so it's still a little bit of a breeze, but it's nice, really nice. So uh, we are at the top of Esk Pike now. <sighs> Absolutely unreal, I mean, Scarfell Pike, just here, behind me, over this way. So, uh, two people are already at the top that I can see. <sighs> what an absolute view, unreal. Just shows you how quick the clouds come in. Absolutely insane. 
<laughs> it is, however, just on the uh, set of whale campers. Across the clouds here, can't see them at all now. <laughs> Woo! Look at that. This is a nice little uh, rocky bit coming down from Esk Pike. Quite liking it. Keeps you, you know, on your toes really. But it looks absolutely crazy to all that rock formations. <laughs> I love all these clouds coming right thick and then next thing boom <laughs> gone absolutely crazy but I love it <laughs> so anyways we're nearly to the halfway point and then we're going to end up stuck doubling back on the south. I mean, now the clouds have gone on this side, the view right down. Not quite sure what lake that is down there, but absolutely unreal view right the way down to it. I mean, I'd quite happily set up tent here tonight as long as I could have that view it morning again. Be absolutely unreal. Wow. I mean, you can't even see Esk Pike. Absolutely swamped the clouds at the minute, but yeah, well. But we're on his way round now. We're at the top of the loop, so we are gonna go round towards Rosette Pike, and then back down, and that should be this uh, loop or circular walk done and then hopefully we've got enough time which we should have we'll be doing another walk yes might as well get the walks here don't we once the weather's nice hey. as you can see now Esk Pike behind Bofell behind and not one cloud in sight now <laughs> which is just my luck because every time i'm at the top of a peak wanting to get nice views nothing absolutely nothing <sighs> oh well we'll crack on there I mean, clouds are going now, so uh, it's really letting me see everything around me. Absolutely love this place. <sighs> wow. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to have to uh, plan a route where I have a... Uh, a wild camp 
along here but yeah definitely definitely coming back here unreal wow So, uh, just up beside me here is the uh, beautiful Angle Tarn, but absolutely swamped with wild campers. I mean, don't get me wrong, if you were scared to ever do one on your own, you know, for the first time, probably might be best, you know, coming here if there's a fair few. I mean, I've counted 12 tents. So, if you're ever, you know, worried about your first time, probably get yourself in here. You know, it looks like a popular spot, you know. But, yeah, not for me, too many people. I'd rather be away, you know, I can do my own little thing and, and not have to worry about anyone else or my sleep being interrupted. Because I like my sleep. Nice, so absolutely beautiful. So we're uh, just about to go to the top of Rosette Pike. Don't think it's majorly steep, but it's just another one ticked off the list, you know, of peaks that I've been to. Plus, I might as well do it, it's on me, it's on me route, you know, back down. We're now at the top of the Zet Pike and I mean the views absolutely <sighs> stunning. Absolutely. Wow. Nice is this. What a day for Charles and what a route. You know, absolutely unreal. And it's only about 20 past eight. So, looks like I will be able to go do my other route. I'll see what time it is then. I might even uh, extend it, maybe. You know, see what else I uh, I can go before I uh, pitch up tent. I pitch up camp for the night. Yes. Well, I uh, I could time this one perfect. I mean, it's quarter to nine now. And you can see the uh, the trail heading up to uh, going towards Angle Town. There's a fair few people 
coming up it now, so I mean, I think I've timed it perfect myself, but I don't like a busy route. As I've said before, so, you know, wait up, good bit of timing. So we're there, we're nearly down and done from the uh, windy, awful descent from the Zeta Pike, and then we'll be onto smooth land, you know, right the way back towards my car then. I'm gonna stock up on my water and then head back out on another walk. Seeing as the weather's nice and it's only early, but there is uh, quite a lot of people heading up towards Angle Town now. So I'd say I probably timed it right myself. Not worse than a busy path. <laughs> so I am uh, finally down now from the Zet Pike after going down that awful snaky path all the way down. I mean, sure there's a better way to get down but yeah finally that's all the way so we're all on just the, the flat land now right the way back now to the car where I'll stock up on my water and then uh, I can get out on the, another walk but I'll be doing a different video for that so you'll have to uh, watch the other one Yeah, top had to come off, absolutely dying with it and I thought, well, rather than ended up with truckers tan, might as well just take it off, Anna. I'm going to be here for two days. I'm not really bothered who's evening. That's brilliant. Now then, that is uh, just about it for the end of this walk, you know. It was really nice getting to the top of Bofell and then Esk Pike. Even better view when we got to uh, Rosetta Pike because the clouds had disappeared then. But yeah, I've uh, absolutely loved this walk and uh, certain parts of it I'm going to come back probably wild camp. So uh, yeah, yeah. Overall, I actually really love this place. So uh, yeah, I'll be on to me second walk of the day soon. So uh, I'm not going to say where we're going just yet. You'll see by watching the next one. But if you like the video, don't forget hit the subscribe button, hit a like. Much appreciated. See you on the next one. Cheers.